Hello friends and welcome to another tutorial on Geeks for Geeks. In this video, we are going to understand the program which does the in-order traverse without recursion or stack. First, let us take an example. We pass root of tree and output the in-order traversal without using any extra space. Now, let us have a look at the algorithm. Let us also have a sample tree to test our algorithm. We pass the root node to function in order. Hence, root will point to 10. We take a left done variable and initialize it to false. As root is not null, we enter the while loop. We check if left child is not traversed and find the leftmost child. As left done is false, we set root to root's left. So, root will point to 5. Next, we print root. Hence, 5 is printed. We make left done true. Now we check if right child of root exists. Since right child of 5 doesn't exist, we move to parent. Now in this program, the structure of the binary tree will hold left, right and parent. So, we have the parent node stored which is 10 for 5. As root is not equal to root's parent's right and root has a parent child, we set root to root's parent. Hence, root will point to 10. As root is not null, we continue with the while loop. Now, left done is true, so we print root. Now as root has a right child, we set left done to false and set root to root's right. We continue with the while loop. As left done is false, we set root to root's left. So root will point to 80. Next we print root. So 80 is printed. We make left done true. As right child doesn't exist. We go to the else if part and now set root to root's parent. So root will point to 100. As root is not null but left done is true, we print root. So 100 will be printed. We check if right child of root exists. As it is true, we make left done to false and set root to root's right. We continue with the while loop and now print 120. We make left done true. Now as root is equal to root's parent's right, we set root to root's parent. Again as root's parent exists and root is equal to root's parent's right, we set root to root's parent. So root will point to 10. As 10 does not have a parent, we break and control will come out of the while loop. With this, we come to an end of this tutorial. For any doubts or suggestions, please leave them in the comment section below. Thank you for watching.